So do we do grid sampling? Do we do zone sampling? How do we sample our fields? Part of that has to do with on what are we trying to do? We believe very strongly for calcium management, grid sampling is a great tool. And therefore, if we want to adjust that pH, we should use the grids to figure out how to do that. We vary a little bit from some of the others. We've been taught over and over again that we have to grid sample for NP and K management. And while there is some people who believe strongly in that, we believe more strongly in equal opportunity nutrition for every plant. So what are we going to do? We're going to go out and sample it like you plant it. And the way that is, is if you start at the east end and you go to the west end, whatever's in that tank in the way of micronutrients, starter fertilizer, all of the different things you're going to put in, that is in the same tank at the other end so therefore we're looking for a composite now before you go crazy and say oh yeah but you got a grid sample because different areas need different things let me share some yield maps with you if you'd be interested in taking a look how this can work out for you because that's the bottom line what works out for you and if you'd be interested in that reach out to us and we'll show you some results